pop up this pedal housing with this flat bar and I'm going to mount it into this existing mount that was for the gas pedal I'm happy to say that the pedal mount is done I used the same bolt that used the gas pedal I need to trim this cap to in order to fit over these bolts I finally, finally discarded to put the box here because it wasn't easy to get off the go-kart and also and it, it's fixed underneath and goes to this bar and the twin caliper mount is also finished and this thing and I need also to make a bushing on the lathe to put it here but other than that I'm now ready to start the main wiring which is this thick wires <laughs> Five hours after the twin caliper mount is complete, the controller is wired. I was going to root the wires, rear the seat, but I got them. under the seat through here I needed to move the emergency button from here to here because this wire is too rigid to have it mounted and be able to open it and close we have the contactor and then the negative and the positive go to this massive connector then through an adapter to be able to use this battery battery this one and the batteries are now secured to the aluminum plate at the bottom so yes this is the progress five hours later I have everything ready for tomorrow to start soldering and doing the wiring. almost ready for a test drive 
because the only thing remaining is the way the wiring harness from the controller to this connector that I need to install. But other than that, temperature sensor there, voltage, and I'm reading of the 12 volt system. USB to charge the tablet that will be installed on the st steering wheel and the main switch that activates the main contactor and this button is for the pre-charge circuit that is here with the pre-charge resistor, this one So yes, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next episode.